Hi, this is Carl Anderson with Marine Max Charleston, and I'm here at Charleston Harbor Marina at Patriots Point in Mount Pleasant. And I'm very excited to show you our latest arrival here in Charleston, the all-new Azmit 51 Atlantis. Starting off here in the swim platform, this is a submersible hydraulic swim platform with non-skid material throughout. As you can see, we have on the port side an access to the side gunnels and the bow area. Here at the transom, we've got a fold-out electric Kenyan grill. This entire area beneath the aft sunbed is a large powered tender garage. We've got extra wide access way to the uh, main deck with fresh water as we enter. Triple wide, very comfortable, very expansive aft facing sunbed area with four stainless steel cup holders incorporated into the battle line material, which is an upgraded material that's heat resistant, extra durable, and breathable. As we enter the cockpit, a very large cockpit door with substantial stainless hardware. We've got six foot, five inches of headroom. We've got a storage area or a cooler just opposite the L-shaped settee, which surrounds a fiberglass pedestal table that opens and expands, which also has a synthetic marble inlay. Both this table and the television just opposite are powered to raise and lower. To the starboard side, we've got pull-out stools that can join the dinette area with storage beneath where they otherwise stow away. So this is a great entertaining space. Further forward, we've got a prep area and a wet bar sink. with a refrigerator and an ice maker just beneath. As you can see, seamless transition from the aft social zone to the cockpit here, tremendous natural light, single piece windshield. We've got a powered retractable roof. So we've got great lighting, great lighting. We've got great ventilation. We also have two manual windows on the, each side of the boat. To the port side, we've got a versatile space here. So with the cushion folded out, we've got a nice lounger. And with it folded back, we have more of a traditional seat with storage beneath. We've also got more storage further forward. I always love what Azimut does at the helm. Your captain's chair and your observer seat are very comfortable. Each have their own adjustable bolster and each of these seats slide forward and aft when seated they uh, fit your body very comfortably it's also a very comfortable leaning position with the angled footrest here at the helm large touchscreen from ray marine we've got our volvo penta um, evc or our electronic vessel um, controls display Autopilot from Ray Marine. This is a joystick boat powered by twin IP or 600 horsepower IPS 800 pod drives. We've also got bow and stern thruster, and this boat does have a Seakeeper 6 gyro stabilizer. Really well appointed helm area, nice leather wrapped steering wheel on an adjustable tilt. And all of my controls are here at the dash with uh, rocker, rocker switches, and I also have two USB ports to charge my devices here. You can see I can easily and quickly close up the sunroof. We'll leave that open for now for lighting. Great visibility 
We'll see when we go to the bow, but the uh, windshield wipers have stainless steel supports and frames, so very sturdy. But now let's make our way down below. So down below, we're in the salon and the galley of the 51 Atlantis from Azimuth. Here in the salon, we've got a C-shaped settee that surrounds a solid wood pedestal table that's on a fixed pedestal. You can see the table expands and has four stainless steel cup holders and a stainless grab handle for support. We've got a hull side window to the starboard side, two storage doors just above us. Forward, we have a very large mirror that helps accent and accentuate the natural lighting that we get in this space. Our distribution panel is conveniently placed just above the settee. We've also got access to climate controls and a Fusion stereo remote. Fusion speakers are above, along with good lighting. Continuing our entertainment area, we've got a 40-inch flat screen television from Samsung with a Bose soundbar and storage beneath. Moving over to the galley, all Miele appliances. We've got a four burner induction cooktop, combination convection oven and microwave, storage with a trash receptacle with two bins. We've got drawer storage and cabinet style storage on a soft close. Stainless steel basin sink. As you can see another whole side window to the port side. More storage above. And we have a very large full size refrigerator and freezer. So plenty of space for a long weekend or a longer excursion. And then before we transition into the master stateroom, which is forward, we've got more storage here along with our direct TV set top box. So here in the master stateroom of the 51 Atlantis from Azimuth, we've got a large island berth, storage that's repeated on both sides. More drawer storage to the port side. Another direct TV set top box here. Two hanging closets, one to port and one to starboard. The starboard side does have a safe. Here we've got a pretty unique setup here. So we've got a fold out vanity with a sliding stool. This locks back into place. And then our television is actually concealed behind a mirror, so we've got another flat screen TV from Samsung. Beneath the berth, we've got two pull out storage drawers that have storage within storage. And again, both of those are on a soft close. The head area, so here in the master head, We've got a shower wand and a rainfall feature. Plenty of headroom. Window with ventilation. Storage. Behind the mirrors. A nice sink. Storage beneath that as well. And now we'll transition to the VIP and guest stateroom. So before we head to our VIP and guest staterooms, we do have a combo washer dryer unit just opposite what serves as the day head or the guest head. Shower wand, sink, Whole side window with ventilation storage above, very similar to what we saw in the master head. The guest stateroom has over under bunks with storage above. 
full-size mirror with storage behind it, and a television for the top bunk. The VIP stateroom has two twin berths that can either slide together as they're shown here, or they can be separated. We've got another flat, flat screen television from Samsung, Bose sound bar, large storage closet here, large mirror, We've got a vanity area, We've got storage above the two beds. And more pull out drawer storage just beneath the vanity. We'll transition back upstairs. So, here on the bow of the 51 Atlantis from Azmuth, we've got a very large forward facing chase lounge with four stainless steel cup holders in that same battle line material. We've got pop up lighting, and you can see the backrests here have really solid stainless steel hardware supports on gas struts. Beneath this canvas, we have a pop-up cabana as well, so we can also shade this area. When the backrests go down flush when stowed away. So that's a look at our Azimut 51 Atlantis. Again, I'm Carl Anderson with Marine Max Charleston. Give us a call at 843-747-1889 and always visit us at marinemax.com. Thank you very much and thanks for watching.